Hello everyone, it's Jessica and welcome back to my channel and welcome to this week's thrifting in 2022 video. So I did almost leave today's trip empty handed, but I did find something right at the last minute and I will share with you my pretty unique find at the end of today's video. But first I'm going to show you all of the interesting things that caught my eye on today's trip. And let me know down in the comments which of these items were your personal favorite. I would love to hear from you. And if you enjoy thrifting content like this, I do post new videos every week. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family, so don't forget to hit that subscribe button on your way out. Okay, to all my rooster collectors out there, check out this Chiquita Banana rooster that I spotted. I thought it was pretty funky and kind of cool. I've never seen anything quite like this before. So I did almost purchase this tea light candle holder to hang outside on my back patio. I thought it was really pretty. I did end up putting it back just because the chain was really rusty. It was also missing some links and the little candle holder portion down inside was also broken. So unfortunately I did pass on it. And speaking of broken items, I came across this cute little red cabinet. I thought it was so cute. And as you can see, I'm kind of struggling here with the door. It was missing a hinge or something, but it was still a great deal at $1.99. I'm sure someone can fix this. I'm pretty sure this piece right here is uranium glass, but without a black light, it's kind of hard to tell for sure. The lid was chipped in a couple of different places, but it was a great deal at $1.98 and it's going to look lovely in somebody's collection. So let me know down below in the comments if you collect uranium glass and let me know how many pieces you have in your collection. I would love to know. So this next piece was really cool and I did use my Google Lens feature on my phone to see what came up and I did find someone's Etsy listing and it's being described as a hand-blown Murano style vase slash candle holder and they have it on sale for $29.
So for all of my butterfly collectors out there, I know there's a few of you, I did spot this beautiful crystal butterfly trinket dish. I thought it was a great deal at $1.98 and I just had to share it with you guys. And the last item that I wanted to share with you today from this trip was also something that I had to talk myself out of not buying because I really didn't need another basket. But this one right here was a really good deal. It was $5.27. It was really big. It had handles and a lid. You can use this as a hamper, a trash can, a toy bin. You could even put a large plant down in here. So I just had to share it with you guys. So like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, I almost walked out empty handed on today's trip, but I had a peek in one of the cases before I left and I spotted this really cool coconut ladle with a hand carved wood handle. So I had to check it out. So it looks like two people must have priced this item on accident. On the side of the handle, there was a price of $4.78, but on the bottom of the ladle, there was a price of $1.39. And the cashier at Goodwill did honor the lower price of $1.39, so I was really thrilled about that. And right here, I'm just using a magic eraser to get both of those prices off. And I was also curious to find out what these retail for brand new. I found an Amazon listing for about $20 and also an Etsy listing for $35. And I'm not sure if you guys remember, but a couple of months ago, I thrifted the coconut bowl that you see on the right-hand side of the screen. It goes perfectly with this ladle, and I hope to find more coconut bowls in the future to add to my collection. When I was looking at the Etsy listing, I noticed it was also being described as like a watering ladle to water plants. So I thought I would try it out on my Monstera plant. It was due for a watering. And right now I currently have it stored here in my kitchen inside of my utensil crock with all of my other utensils. So that is my one little thrift find for this week. Peanut definitely approved of this because she knows that ladle could potentially pour some yummy things into her food bowl. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it inspires you to go out and go thrifting. You never know what you're going to find out there. Sometimes you find a lot of things. Sometimes you find one thing like I did today, or sometimes you don't find anything. That's what's great about thrifting. You just never know what you're going to find. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next week with a new thrifting video.